I am going to get Miss Prim up for school. And um, yeah, so usually she lays here and I get her milk and she kind of drinks it in her bed and just kind of relaxes. Good morning, honey. Good morning. She's not fully awake yet, but yeah, so that's what we're going to do. Got her milk poured and I'm gonna give it to her while I get ready. Hey guys, so I went to get ready and Prim came in and she is like screaming and I'm not sure why. Um, she usually just drinks her milk and it's fine, but she feels warm, so she feels warm to me. So I'm going to um, take her temperature and see what's going on with her. So I just took her temperature and it's 101. So it's pretty high, so I'm going to call in to work and call her into school, obviously. And I'm just going to hang out with her, to her today. Um, she already is kind of falling asleep, I think. So I'm just holding her, trying to comfort her. Um, but she's like shivering and she's warm at the same time. So I know something is up with her. So. Yeah, I'll keep you guys updated, but for now, I'm just gonna cuddle her. Okay, guys, so I'm trying to give Prim some water um, to, to keep her hydrated. She hasn't thrown up yet, and um, I wanna keep it that way, but I wanna make sure that she gets some fluids into her system just to help with um, keeping her hydrated and um, to help her body fight off whatever she has because she has a fever. So obviously something is up with her body. So I'm trying to give her some water. Go. Here we go. She's drinking a little bit. But she does not feel good. She's really clinging to me. She doesn't want me to put her down. So I've kind of had her on my hip all morning, but that's okay, I don't mind. She doesn't feel good. When babies don't feel good, all they want is their mommy, so. Um, good girl, she's drinking her water. So um, I was gonna give her like some fruit or something also because it's mostly water. And um, I'm sure some cool fruit will taste good. So um, yeah, that's what's going on right now. I'm just trying to get her to drink some and just kind of sitting with her and um, rubbing her back and trying to um, you know, comfort her as much as I can. So, yeah. But like I said, she's my cuddly girl today. So, um, that's what's going on right now. I will definitely keep you guys updated on her fever and, um, she's doing she still feels warm but she kind of is in that like um, dazed fever <laughs> type of feeling but she doesn't feel that warm her fever um, wasn't like it was high but it wasn't super duper high which was good so um, I don't know if it's like she's getting her molars or what because she's not drooling that much but you can tell she just isn't herself so she wanted nothing to do with her milk, which she usually loves. So I know something's up with her. So yeah, I'm just cuddling her. I'm getting some snuggle time in, and um, we'll keep you guys updated on what's going on with her. Sip of water, which is good. So, um, 
I'm just going to let her sleep as long as she wants. We're going to kind of take this day as it comes and um, just let her recuperate. And um, yeah, so I'm just going to let her sleep. And um, I'll get back to you when she wakes up. I woke up. It's about 12.30 now. She took a long nap. I think the medicine made her sleepy, but um, she's watching the pirate fairy. Um, she's really obsessed with Tinkerbell movies as of late, so she's lying here with her passy. She's got her water, and um, she's just kind of relaxing on this little couch here, and she's watching this. Um, I'm making lunch. I don't think she'll want to eat anything, but I'm going to offer her like some crackers or something just to nibble on because she hasn't really eaten today, so I want to make sure that she has something to eat. But, um, yeah, she's just laying here watching her movie, and, um, yeah, so I'll get back to you later. Hey, guys, so it's about 2.45, and, um, I finally got free to eat something. I wanted to keep it really easy on her stomach, so I gave her some bananas and crackers, and I filled up her water cup a couple times, and she's still watching her movie, um, she's really overcast and kind of gloomy outside, so, um, that's why the lighting is so bad, but um, after this, I'm going to see if she'll play a little bit, um, or she might take another nap, I don't know, but she doesn't seem too tired, she's pretty engrossed in the movie, so um, she'll probably finish up her lunch, I guess, breakfast lunch, and um, we'll see where we're at from there. Hey guys, so she's having a fit because she wants to get down, she finished the movie and her like, breakfast snack thing, and so... Good gravy. Okay, she wants to get down, but it's too tall. So, okay, I'm gonna get you down. And we're gonna go play now. Okay, guys, we're in the nursery and she's playing. Um, I wanted her to play with more soft toys and not super loud, annoying toys. Just because she still doesn't feel well. And so she's got like her bare baby bottle, some soft books, you know, more quiet things. She has her blanket wrapped around her. So she's going to play a little bit. Um, I'm going to start making some dinner. And um, yeah, it's just been a quiet day. Um, I'm going to put her to bed early because she's already seeming to be a little bit tired. So um, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to put the babies in the night. Oh, it's time for them to go to sleep. the blankie. Good job, Prim. Such a good little mommy. Telling me that she was hungry and it's about dinner time. It's a little later than that, but she was hungry and she was um, pointing at her tummy and it was growling. So um, I made some chicken noodle soup for her. It's homemade and um, it's really tasty. It's got carrots, celery, chicken, garlic, parsley, some noodles in there, um, and so I'm going to help her because the pieces are a little big, and so um, I'm just going to cut them up and um, let the soup cool down a little bit, but she's looking at it. I think she's hungry, so it's just still a little hot. She will not eat all of this. Uh, I'll, I'd be surprised if she ate half of it, so um, she still doesn't really have an appetite, but I thought just in case, you know, she might decide that she likes it and wants to eat more of it, so I gave her a little bit more than she would probably eat normally, but um, that's for dinner. So she ate more than I thought she would, which is good, and now she's kind of just staring at the cats and off into space, so um, yeah, I don't think she's going to eat anymore, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean her up and then put her in the bath, put some new pajamas on her. 
her to bed. I'm gonna put her to bed early because she's already acting tired. So um, I'm gonna put her to bed and um, give her another dose of medicine actually for her bath, just in case she you know throws a fit and gets it all over the place. I can just clean her up in the bath. So that's what's gonna happen for now. And um, yeah, so we'll talk to you soon. Okay guys, so I have her medicine here. The doctor gave her some sort of like blue raspberry twisty turny loopy loo <laughs> flavor. So um, I'm gonna try to give it to her much as your PJs, Prim. Yeah, so we're gonna try to get her to um, drink this, but she's not too much of a fan. Okay, come on Prim, it's time to have your medicine. Prim, come on now. Okay, well, this is gonna be interesting, so I'm gonna try to get her to drink it. So this sounds mean, but I'm gonna have to hold her head while I try to give it to her, so. I know, I know. Good girl. She took it all. She didn't really fuss too much, so that's awesome, good job. So now um, I'm going to run her bath and get her all cleaned up. Hey guys, so she got out of the bath and she has some new pajamas on. They're like little mermaid ones. She's got her passy. She's getting tired, but I don't want to put her to bed this early. It's like super early and so um, I'm going to hold off a little bit longer, but we are coloring. We're doing some mother-daughter coloring. So. I forgot how like therapeutic coloring can be. So she's in charge of the pumpkins, which I think she thinks are apples, but <laughs> it's okay. It's our artistic expression. It's the only thing that matters. So um, yeah, we're just working on some coloring and Stella um, is joining us momentarily. <laughs> We're gonna finish this picture, I think, and then um, we'll go to bed. But um, I think this is the right color for her. She's more of an orange, isn't she? Oh well, it's too late now. So, um, yeah, I'm just coloring our little picture. And um, she's acting a lot better. Than she was. She's still pretty tired, but I think that's honestly that's the um, medicine. And um, so I think that is what's making her so drowsy. So um, I think she's getting better. I still want to check her temperature um, before. Bed. So we'll see. Uh, I think she doesn't feel that warm to me, honestly. So I'm wondering if um, you know she she's better. It could be the medicine working, but I felt her before I gave her her second dose, like when I picked her up and stuff, and she didn't feel um, she didn't feel that warm to me. So hopefully she's feeling better. That would be great. So, um, yeah, I'm just gonna finish up this picture with Prim because I'm pretty sure she would be heartbroken if we didn't finish it. And, um, we'll get back to you. Good job. You coming? Yeah. What are you gonna get? You done with that color? Prim. Okay. Might be time for bed. Hey, beautiful. Are you enjoying the crayons? Yeah. All right, so here is our finished picture. AKA Prim was having a meltdown and so couldn't finish it. But um, yes, they didn't give Applejack and Iris, which I thought was strange. So I gave her one myself. So yeah. Interesting photo. You can tell that Prim's favorite colors are purple and red. 
these days, so those were the only colors she wanted to use. So, or maybe she thought that it was eggplant and apples, who knows, with this child lately. But um, yeah, just thought to show you our little picture. 981! Yay! That's great, Prim! You don't have a fever anymore. You can't have this. <laughs> Want me to take your temperature? I don't think you'd like where if the thermometer has to go. Hey guys, so Prim is in bed. I decided to give her milk because her fever was normal. She hasn't thrown up and she's been acting a little bit fussy, but not like super sick since about five o'clock. Ever since we started to eat dinner, really, she kind of has been back to her normal self. And so um, I decided to give her milk and she hadn't really eaten a lot today. So I wanted to get her some extra calories in. So um, just in case I mixed it with some Pedialyte, some unflavored Pedialyte, just to get her electrolytes back up had she lost any in her fever. So um, she's going to drink her bottle and then I'm going to put her to bed. So I'm going to ready for bed, aren't you? It's been a long day. Bit. Look at her feet. <laughs> Silly girl. So, just gonna pat her a little bit before she goes to sleep. Alright, guys, she's asleep. It took all of about 10 minutes to get her down. So, this is where I'm going to end. This is where I'm going to end this video.